What it do, what it do, what it do. It's your boy, Shelly Cell, and we back in here for another episode of Juice City Legends. If you have not, please hit the like button. Please subscribe. All right, gang, we back in here, man, with another one. And this is a video right here I've been wanting to work, work on for a couple of weeks now, but with everything going on, the Thanksgiving, uh, the untimely death of Young Dolph or whatever, I really didn't get time to just get into it, but... uh. You know what I'm saying? I'm about to get into this, man. I'm going to call this right here the year of the quarterback, man. This is one of the greatest years in uh, Mississippi football, college football, in my, that I can remember in uh, recent years or whatever. So uh, we want to give a shout out to these young men and they had a, a hell of a year. First off, we want to give a congratulations to Ole Miss quarterback, Matt Carell for winning the uh, the Connolly Award. Now, the Connolly Award is a, a prestigious award that was named after Old Miss legend Charlie Connolly. Um, it's given out every year to Mississippi's top football player, college football player. Matt, he had an excellent year. Uh, he had over 3,000 yards, 20 Passing touchdowns with only four interceptions, uh, leading Ole Miss to a record of uh, ten and two. I think that's a record. They uh, they rank Ole Miss is ranked number eight in the country right now. Ole Miss um, has a chance to play in a BCS game, uh, so they had a great year thanks to Matt. These are some of his stats right here. Congratulations to Matt Carrera. We want to give a congratulations to Mississippi State sophomore quarterback, Brandon Mississippi native, Will Rogers. Now, Will, he had an excellent year. Um, unfortunately, they lost the Egg Bowl this year to Miss the Ole Miss, uh, but they had a, a great year. They pulled off some upsets. Uh, Will had uh, over 4,000 yards like 34 touchdowns or something like that to only eight interceptions. Will, uh, he's coming back next year. You can mark my words. In 2022, Will Rogers will be a Heisman candidate. Once again, once again, we want to give a congratulations to Will Rogers, man. Good job. Last but not least, we want to give a congratulations to Jackson State freshman, the son of legendary Hall of Famer, Deion Sanders, Shador Sanders, a congratulations for you winning SWAC Freshman of the Year. Now, Shador had one heck of a season. Shador passed for almost 3,000 yards. He had 28 touchdowns with only five interceptions, and I want to say he ran for at least four touchdowns. Shador led the Jackson State Tigers to a 10-1 and record. This weekend, they will be competing against Prairie View in the SWAC championship game. I have my money on JSU. Congratulations, Shador Sanders. Once again, I want to give a congratulations to all three of these young men, Will Rogers, Matt Carell, and Shador Sanders. You all had an a excellent year. Uh, I watched each one of you, every time I had the chance to watch Old Miss, Mississippi State, Mississippi State, or Jackson State, I was sure to tune in. Uh, like I say, man, uh, Matt, we won't see you anymore. I'm hearing he's going to be a first-round draft pick. Shador, we have three more years to, to get to watch you. Will, we looking forward to seeing you. You're making everybody proud being a Mississippi native. Uh, I just want to... Uh, just congratulate you guys, man. It was one of the more uh, entertaining years in football that I have seen in a long time in the state of Mississippi. And uh, I enjoyed every every bit of uh, watching you guys play. Congratulations. Much success. Stay blessed. This has been another episode of Juice City Legends. Hey, if you like the, the channel, please hit the like button. Please subscribe. I thank everybody for watching the channel. Uh, we have more content on the way. Just stay tuned. Peace.